Ahoy, fellas. I have come to something of decision channel-wide. I'm not sure how much I'm going to really spend talking about this. Time. Come on. Show yourself. I'm just going to restart at that point. Holy God. Yep. But, basically, I've come to the, something of the decision that I uh, I may or may not uh, keep doing the same kind of schedule. By that, I mean what I have been doing. Um, well, I guess I can just easily explain this through this. It's like mid to late January, early February, right? I'm recording this um, October 29th. So, yeah. I've been doing this for a little while. I ended up... Um, it's been like a week since I've recorded anything as of here, but I mean this is kind of what I mean by talking about there's almost not too much point in saying anything because um, it shouldn't really be noticeable to the viewer if there's a change on my end in terms of recording and scheduling videos. So for me it ends up being I'm going to end up not recording for a little while. Like, say, um, a couple months at this point, because I have stuff backed up to January at current. The only thing that that's different about is um, blasphemous. And I mean, that's not going to be a problem for me because, while I'm not entirely sure about. Okay. Should have thought about that a bit more. While I'm not entirely sure about. Um, when exactly, um, got, again, this is, um, what I mean about this being weird to talk about for me being you only personal. climb high because your heart in, might in question won't crack in a fall. Lol. So it, it honestly doesn't matter all that much when um, not Strife and Ruin, Strife and Ruin already came out, but, um, when exactly, uh, the, the last DLC for Blasphemous comes out, or really how much content it has, because I can just play the game, you know, and I'm hoping that it has maybe a bit more than a couple weeks worth of content, because I won't be able to do that until early December when it comes out, which is like December 9th, I want to say, which again isn't a problem, but it's also not something that will be noticeable for the viewer, because those videos will have come out already. I just, um, I guess this is, this is the one problem in my plan here, where I'm not sure how much content will come out of that DLC, so I'm not sure if I can really plan on making a week, like a week's worth of content from the DLC, because, I mean, for all I know, it's like quality of life changes, and then I'm going to have to very quickly. There, in the conservatory, the chief had stationed his best, bravest men. Ooh. I would leave them a gibbering, terrified mess. Of course we would. I had a choice. Terrify the chief's men. But leave them alive to tell the story. No doubt with great exaggeration. No, of course. <laughs> or let the fear spread with blood and precision, leaving just a few terrified survivors. I like the first one a bit better, though, of course. Use a suspended block trap to terrify a bandit. I'm not entirely sure what that means, but you know. But anyways, um... I'll have to switch gears relatively quickly to basically make... Oh, okay, I see. That's just a ending the, ep the level kind of objective. God, I really need to have a consistent way of going the roofs about were tiled with old slates all overgrown with brambles. Wacky. I could drop them on the bandits and leave them stunned. And if any of their friends saw... I knew you were not in terror. Wow. 
That's gonna show up every single time, isn't it? Love. It always made me sad when I hung a body in front of his own comrades. Ooh. Sad when they saw he was gone. And sadder when they were too scared to care. When your fur turns gray, that light blue heart will be. Walk death while you can. Anyways, I'm still not entirely sure. I already said this. Blasphemous is going to be wacky, but that's the only kind of dip in my plans. Because I can very, I can well enough make, oh. Oh! Wacky. I can well enough make videos for Blasphemous right to... Um, where I have the rest of the series right now, which is January. Because at current, I think the farthest up I've gotten with Blasphemous has been, like, again, early January. Oh. Wow. That's, uh... That was pretty, was our greatest weapon. pretty simple. Remember, they didn't truly know who we were or what we could do. Lol. One man striking from the shadows would seem like an army. <laughs> Morons. But yeah, not sure what I'm gonna do or what that means for early December. Um, but it should be well enough. Taken care of, that it won't be too much of a problem. Okay, pal. So that being said, um, I'm gonna start saying things that are a bit more relevant temporally, or oh well, yeah, just tem temporally. Okay, pal. I guess I have to hit him with it. Didn't terrify him? Aw, oh, come on. Yeah, okay, fine. It's not like I actually have to redo all this. will be fun. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm hoping to just generally have more to say during these videos, because, I mean, There's nothing here. You've, you've seen me do any of these, if you've spent basically any amount of time on the channel and boy do I not talk about them all that much um, but yeah, it shouldn't be a problem just generally I don't imagine it becoming a problem for me making these uh, I just mean that um, there will eventually come a time when I can no longer make videos I guess that's not overly ideal but I mean, can't, not everyone can do this for a living. <laughs> I'm hoping that guy doesn't see this. Okay. But yeah. It, um, again, it won't become a problem until much, much later. But I will just eventually fall out of this. And that was not something that I was thinking too much about idealistically because I would rather not really have to again that would be ideal if I could keep doing this 
be fun and all. But I will, of course, also eventually run out of money in games. So, you know, got to make it back somehow. <laughs> and I, I doubt I'll be really making the kind of quality content that operates at a, at a net positive. I just, I don't see myself having or really honestly taking the effort to give myself the kinds of um, ability in terms of editing and things like that that would allow for the creation of better content. I don't know. Again, it wouldn't be terribly hard to do. Um, but it, it's, it's time put in that I don't really care to put into it. So, yeah. That's really a me problem, but mm, well, let's blame it on the, the, the market. Why not? <laughs> wonder if I can hide these in the door frames. No, I can't. Okay, I'll just toss them around. Why not? Okay, terrified guard. Not a problem. Okay, he's, he's looking to be a bit of a problem. Okay, never mind. He's not a problem. I'm not going to lie, I don't know where all of them are. Okay, that makes that much simpler. Very nice. I like how this guy's not even dead. He was crushed. Oh, yeah, that's what it was. They're covered in brambles, but they're not, like, deadly. Kind of funny, honestly. Look at him hang there. <laughs> Suckers. What? It was your mother. Closer. It was your mother. I don't know what you're talking about. My baby, what are you doing here? Why do I say things like this? Here's what we do. Blank. Incapacitated. No. Let this man pseudo climb the stairs. I guess I do need to terrify them in the end, so yeah, he'll see. Or not. Or maybe he won't see that. Okay, I'll just take him out then. Fine. You're useless to me. Sheesh. Anybody down here? Nope. Okay, I see him now. Alright. But yeah, don't be too overly surprised when I eventually run out of things get closer what was that come on yeah whatever dude let's take it out and good job very nice I like how I get like a lot of points for friendly fire it's kinda wacky I don't know how well this is gonna go. Cause I don't um hopefully he turns around. Or not. Doesn't matter. Okay. We did it guys. I was also supposed to terrify more bandits, but I mean I've gotten enough points for this. Come on, let's be honest here. We got one more bandit anyways. We beat the crap out of him. You know? And then that'll be the end of the episode. Yes, sirree. <laughs> Just frickin' murder him. Well, I thought he was gonna walk past the urn, but I guess not. Gives me more points. That was the last of them. Yo. Time to go back. Down the torturous secret roads that led home. Hog. Very nice. <laughs> I had delivered a message to the chief, and well, we never had trouble with him again. <laughs> I return to the clan satisfied. Years passed, and I became curious about the ink that I had saved. I studied it and mastered its use. Nobody knows more of its secrets than I do. 
and nobody here values it more. The fate of the clan rests in those drops. And I will do whatever it takes to ensure our future. Wow. And thus concludes Dosan's tale. What a story. Oh, come on. Like heck I was detected. Heck off. Full honor. Full freaking honor. You heard it. You know it. I am a... I'm, I'm a god. Alright? Also, I forgot that I was going to look at the, uh, the other, the other ending. But, you know, that doesn't matter to me. Full honor, fellas! That is the entirety of Mark of the Ninja Remastered, including Dosan's Tale. Hoo-ah! Another series under my belt! I'm so rad! <laughs> But yeah, with that, next week I'm going to be talking about things that are more relevant, maybe, if anything's even going on. I was kind of shying away from that because I don't want to be the type that gets into, um, I don't know, overly polarizing political discussion, I suppose. Because that was one of the things that kind of led me away from a lot of the gaming channels that I enjoyed previously. Like, um, I don't know. Alpha Red I used to watch a lot, because I, I mean, for one, he's actually good at games. That's, this is kind of the criteria that I've come to, that, um, I used to watch Game Grumps, and they're funny, but boy god, do they not pay attention to instructions in games, and it leads to me just screaming at my computer, you know, and they, some of the things that, some of their running series, they're very long, but I mean, I've spent a year playing them. Celeste, so I don't think I can really make judgment calls about that. If a game is long, then a game is long. I try and stry, shy away from things that are like purposefully replayable. Like I, you're never gonna see a Binding of Isaac series, but I I might play it now and again, but I doubt I put it on the channel. But um, so then I watch like Alpha Red and things like that, and. He's pretty funny, and he's also really good at the games he plays. But, I mean, some of the Alpha Red Plus content dips into just a lot of crap, you know? And I get that that's the unedited Jacob, and, like, Alpha Red Normal is pretty nice. But I don't, I, don't, I don't know about the personality, you know? And there's just some of the stuff he says, I guess. No, I mean... That's just me. I probably take it a bit too to heart. Things like that. But I'm not going to say stupid crap. You know? I, I guess that's more of a subjective call, though. I'm not even aiming to be like a first-of-its-kind gaming channel. I just kind of want to play video games. But hey! I'll take it. I'll, I'll go where it leads me. For now, like, comment, and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Next week... I'll be playing something else. I honestly don't know what, but we'll find out. Honestly, maybe Carrion. I've got a beefier computer now, and Carrion seems to attract a lot of people, so you know it. <laughs> For now, goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.